Family and friends walked into one police plaza for the first administrative hearing and for the first time facing the officer who held Eric Garner in a chokehold the day he died. It was mixed emotions. I felt sort of numb uh, being in the same space with my son's murderer. The Civilian Complaint Review Board's prosecuting officer Daniel Pantaleo. He's charged with reckless use of a chokehold and intentional use of a chokehold. An NYPD trial judge will hear both sides and make a recommendation to the police commissioner who has the final say on any penalties. We can't listen to the noise. Let's listen to the evidence. We are going to bring before us evidence that Officer Pantaleya did exactly what he was trained to do. Garner's family says they want Pantaleo and every officer involved in Garner's death to be fired. At this point in time, he, he, he basically needs to suffer for what he's done because, you know, he's able to live his life with his family, but Eric is not able to live his life with his family. Officer Pantaleo wore a dark suit and said nothing during the hearing as both sides discussed the upcoming trial, each saying they'll need five days and present 13 witnesses. During the hearing, a judge denied a motion from Pantaleo's lawyers to drop one of the charges. Unfortunately, what we see in this process is that we're having a trial in front of a kangaroo court. Both parties will be back in court January 31st for an administrative hearing. The trial is slated to begin May 13th. In Lower Manhattan, Clark Foraker, CBS 2 News. A state grand jury on Staten Island chose not to indict Pantaleo after Garner's death four years ago. At the federal level, the Justice Department has until July to decide if it wants to bring charges.